what's going on ladies and gentlemen so kind of a well not kind of a very very much so late start to today as you see it's 4 57 here in new york um <clears throat> very late start like i was saying it's getting dark here in new york i um i laid around a lot today you know contrary to what the online gurus would tell you that you're supposed to you know wake up 4 30 every morning run 13 miles and all that good jazz i'm just now getting started um yeah i decided i owed it to my, owed it to myself i can sleep in if i want to um however i'm craving a milkshake so that's gonna be the first stop for today go get me a milkshake um luckily for me there's a spot right down by the hotel i can go check out and after that i don't know what i'm gonna do might go finish that little Italy vlog or well, vlog trip or whatever I was doing for you guys. And I was also spending these dollars. Go to the club. No, I'm joking. Yeah, man. I'm, I'm going to talk to you guys tomorrow. You know, I feel like a lot of people don't have personality on YouTube. And then another thing. I'm going to talk to y'all as I walk out. Let me make sure I get my key. Because the dude down there, he kind of, the whoever works the second shift, he kind of an Y'all like, comment, subscribe. I haven't been saying that enough. Like, comment, subscribe, all that good jazz. Make sure y'all do that, cause this YouTuber shit is hard. It's not the hardest work, but it is. Um, it's a lot more tiring than I initially imagined. What's the name of this fucking place I'm going to? Van Llewellyn Ice Cream. Van Llewellyn. Van Llewellyn. Van Llewellyn. We got busy last night. In route, go get milkshake. That's what I want. Oh man, <clears throat> the camera died when I was with um, Big Spew, Bo Rakes. So fun. It's so I love saying it like that. I don't know why, but the camera died last night. Um. Yeah, no, I've been craving just a juicy, a dirty, juicy burger. Um, like the past couple weeks, I've just been wanting a burger so bad. And then I've been on a diet, so I haven't been able to have a nice, juicy burger. Last night, let me tell you, I had one. Oh, it was so good. It was oh so good. Boy, it was so good. Oh, it was amazing. It was amazing. There's this place called Mr. Dibs. They, um... There's nothing special about it. It was just greasy. It's all hell. And it was amazing. But yeah. That's not that dark. Never mind. But it's later on in the day here in New York. And this is the warmest that it's, that it's been since I've been here. This is the absolute warm. It's been freezing every single day. I'm so glad I don't need gloves and a hat today. It's crazy. Yo, we 10 minutes in. This is already a vlog. Boom. Cut it right there. Boom. Next one, I'm probably gonna drop like all these back to back to back to back. Gotta really get that algorithm to pick me up, you know, really blow me up. I think this is the spot. That don't make, they do make music like that. It's just totally different now though. In the caddy. Cut that out. I hope I ain't gotta cut that out. Uh, the, the second part that I need to put up when I went and ran the half marathon in Ohio, I need to go put that one up. However, the other part of this challenge of doing YouTube is going to be figuring out how to edit. I have no clue what I'm doing. So that should be fun. Um, where is this place at? Straight down this road. I love all these places like now. 
another thing that I found issue with with me shooting all this content the past few days is um, I look at our freaking Parkinson's. Like, it's, it's so shaky. It's crazy. Oh, boom. That's the place. That's the spot. traffic in there as you can and that's how the ATM business makes their money but it's cash to car that's pretty cool I like that I don't know I'll figure it out yeah. my cool there we go yeah so chocolate chip cookie dough and cookies and cream it's pretty good pretty good oh wow Sensational. Hey, no man. Oh. On second thought, it's probably a bad idea. Oh. Ah, there we go. Bad idea to come sit by the water. I'm sure it's gonna be cold as hell. I'm gonna go grab my hat and I'm gonna come back. Probably the first good decision I've made since I've been here. But this is so good, oh my goodness. But $12 for a milkshake is robbery. I used to work at a, um, what do you call it? The name of it is Freddy's. I used to work there when I was in high school. And um, I used to make milkshakes and stuff for people. It was like, it's like a Sunday, it was like a Sunday place. It was an ice cream place, custard actually. It's richer, creamier, and denser than regular ice cream. We were paid to say that. But um, what do you call it? They, um, uh, fuck it, I guess. What do you, what was I saying? What was I saying? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. so. Whenever people would come in and get sundaes or milkshakes or any of that stuff, I would always play, um, you know, what you, the devil on their shoulder, if you will. Just getting them to throw as many toppings into that as possible. Because for one, it made it way more expensive. And then for two, I wanted everyone to cheat on their diet. You know, just, just, just for fun. It was, it was hilarious to me. But, um, yeah. Thirteen dollars is crazy. I think our milkshakes were like six, seven bucks, which I thought was crazy, but no, apparently you can charge people fourteen dollars for milkshakes and they'll be okay with it. Oh boy. It's so good though. In the middle of the road. Crazy. Crazy. I gotta go pick Stella up on Tuesday. Or is it Mon Wednesday? One of those days I have to go pick up Stella. But I feel kind of bad because I'm gonna have to drop her like right back off like the next week. Oops. I remember what it was. So Alex Ramos, he was like, for with the reasons that something doesn't work out, you want to remove, you know, your work ethic as a variable for why it didn't work out because if you are actually you know when you tell yourself you're going to be all in with something are you actually going to, are you were you actually all in did you actually put forth 
your absolute best effort. So, hold on, and like your best effort. Because obviously, there are some people out there who are doing it and they're you know successful at it. There are people who've had success at that thing that you wanna do. So whenever you're going after something, you want to make sure that you're honest with yourself, right? Like you're actually all in when you do it. And that work ethic isn't one of the reasons that you don't succeed. Because, I mean, that is something that's very well within your control. Y'all think I can sneak into a bar? Think they'll out me? I don't like drinking like that, though. So it's like... It won't make me no difference. If they say yay or nay. Um... I don't know what the fuck I'm gonna do tonight, man. Might go to Brooklyn. Oh, oh, that's the move. We going to Brooklyn. That just popped in my head. That's what we doing. We going to Brooklyn. <sighs> oh, okay. <coughs> we going to Brooklyn tonight. Stand by. Boom. What's going on, people? <sighs> Back outside. We are headed to. Brooklyn! Oh, oh, oh. Nah, oh, I'm um, But yeah, no, I'm, in all seriousness, I really am headed to Brooklyn right now. Um, yeah. I went there the. What day was that? What day was that? What day was that? Day was that? Make sure it's plugged in. Yeah, um. I can't think about what day it was. T lined me up out there, though. So, headed back. Go check out, um. I don't even know. We just, we can go, we can go, check it out, maybe see some funny stuff, get into something, I don't know. Let me show y'all what they sell, hold on, where is that? Uh, I was looking for something to eat, I was like, yo, this sounds dope. All that other stuff, right, it sounds dope. I'm all about eating my veggies and stuff, but do not sound appetizing whatsoever. <clears throat> yeah, that did not sound appetizing whatsoever, especially at the time. I think I ended up getting a lamb euro, which also was not that appetizing. They usually hit. I don't know what was wrong with that one. Uh, but yeah, man, it's crazy. Oh, shit. I don't know, that was a stop sign. What the fuck am I doing? Tripping. Stay off drugs, kids. Stay off drugs. Joking. No, I tell people when I meet them though, I'm like, I'm a recovering alcoholic. I don't know why. I, I, I just lie sometimes for whatever fucking reason. I find it hilarious though. Cause I mean, you honestly know, who you, you never know who you're gonna meet, like who anyone is. So sometimes I just come up with stories to tell people like, oh yeah, man, I was, um, I was a raging alcoholic. Sure, Wall Street is that way because I think I did this last time and missed it yeah missed it okay cool we're going back this way Ooh, blacked out Audi that's like an A3 though still an Audi though nevertheless still an Audi you know all that stuff if that's what you're into not gonna knock you I've done that whole thing, you know, expensive foreign cars and all that. For what? For why? But if you're chasing materialistic possessions, you're never gonna be happy, man. Realize, you know, like, what in the world am I doing with my life? I was, um, so I had a BMW, right? If you guys knew me back then, I'm a change man. I'm a change man. We'll, we'll put it that way. Um, but yeah, so anyway, I had a BMW and I was like, yo, this is cool. I bought it while I was in high school. It was like my graduation present or whatever you want to call it to myself. I was like, yo, this is dope. Get myself a BMW. Cool. Then fast forward, <clears throat> you know, a few months went by, all this. I was like, yo, I'm tired of the BMW. I want to get something else so I was looking around seeing what I could get and I was like yo you know let me get a range or let me get you know obviously you want to level up like 
you want to level up whatever that whatever that is you know but i was like yo let me level up let me step my game up and so i was like all right let me get a range and my my friends who weren't really my friends i mean because i don't really hang out with them like that anyway you know um people who i went to school with though you know, I was talking to him, I'm like, yo, yeah, I'm looking at this range, I want to get, you know, if I was you, I wouldn't get that one, because that's not, you know, the top of the line, that's not this, 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 and this. Like, Nick, you can't even afford to be in this conversation, why, why, why am I listening to you? And I realized, I can't think of it, but I was doing it for other people, I wanted to do it for myself, you know? And so then, all right, we might get on the subway, guys. I I'll finish this whole spiel later. Oh, 